Hello everybody and welcome to another installment of Jude's World. Big hello to you if you're one of my regular viewers and if you're viewing me for the very first time, I live in Selby in the UK and I work for an extremely well-known British supermarket. Now, this morning I am out in Selby and we are going to go and visit the painting pot. So we are actually going to paint this ice cream cone. So this is the before shot. I've just cleaned the inside of that just so that when I paint it, it doesn't come out all mucky. So what we're going to do is we're going to start painting and you've got to paint over three times. So here we go. All this painting's thirsty work, I tell you. But it's great because you feel relaxed, you're in a nice atmosphere, and you can paint away. It's great. Right, so here's the ice cream cone, and you paint each layer three times. And again, I've done it with the top. That one's just not quite dry yet. And again, I've done that on the inside. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to put some little speckles on them. So it's a very, very busy uh, place is the painting pot. And we've just got a couple of painters here. 
Um, would you like to explain what it is you're painting? Just to... So I'm painting a little vase to go on my shelf. And oh, that's beautiful, isn't it? it? Let's just, let's just get birds. a zoom in. Wow, that is fantastic. So the colours are going to go a bit deeper once it's been in the kiln. And so then hopefully it'll be quite vibrant. That is absolutely superb, and Thank you. you are. Yeah, so I've kind of gone with the theme of like scenery and nature, so I've gone for like spring with like the flowers. And oh, like that is. I hope you can all then, see like, this, everybody. <gasps> wow, that so is like, fantastic. Then, like, and, like, and that is absolutely superb. <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you. That is absolutely brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> and we've got a few other painters here. Can I just do a zoom in on what you're doing there? Wow! Oh, I really like them little hearts there. Thank you. Those are superb. And oh, okay. let's have a look. Oh, I love that. Is that a teddy bear? Yeah. That is superb. And oh, can I just have a quick zoom in on that penguin? Oh, there we are. It's okay. I've just got your fingers. Oh, that's it. There we are. I like that little penguin. That is superb. I like the um, I like the I like the beak. <laughs> there we are. Yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. Oh. No, no, no. That's good. No, that's absolutely brilliant. <laughs> I love that. I particularly love that. That is absolutely superb. Sorry, would you mind if we just had a quick? I think that's genius. Wow, that is absolutely superb. Thank you. That is amazing. It's better than mine, I can tell you that much. Right, so back to my own creative masterpiece. So these, they do dry very, very fast. So when you're painting your three layers, they do dry out very, very fast. So we're going to put some little dots on here now. So, fingers crossed. Right, so this is before my artwork goes into the kiln. So obviously it's going to take about a week, but I just wanted to show you this before it goes into the kiln. So this took around about an hour. So yeah, that's, 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 that's pretty impressive. There's my artistic work. So we're going to show you what happens after you've painted. So we are about to take a look in here. Oh, I say. <laughs> so, if you have a look in here, this, <gasps> this is the kiln. Wow. So, once once you've painted your pots, um, I dip them in a clear glaze, which is why these look all blue. This is what I do to everyone's artwork. It's a bit of a shock when they see it looking like this. Fabulous. It gets dipped into, <laughs> into a blue liquid, which is a clear glaze, and that's what makes it really shiny. And then it bakes in this oven overnight. So, if you want to have a look. Oh, wow. Oh. <gasps> These are some pots that have been in there overnight last night. Wow! And they bake at around 1,100, 1,300 degrees for about seven or eight hours. That's pretty um, hot, isn't it? It's pretty hot and it's just cooled down. So at the moment we're looking at 60 degrees, which is about right to be able to open it and take things out. Oh, so wow! So you can see when, when they come out, they do look really shiny. Fabulous! Bright colours. I'm sort of putting that one back down because it feels a little bit hot. But uh, yes. You get, you get an idea of what they, wow. what they come out like. That is absolutely brilliant. And that process takes a week from you from you painting it to, to getting it back. It's about a week. Fantastic. Um, yeah, so you can come into the painting point. You can paint some pottery during the day. Um, we do workshops. Um, so on an evening we look at different glazing techniques and we do different crafts. Like last week we were doing soap making. Um, we've been doing... Um, we do wreath making, glass fusing, things like that. Fabulous! Um, we do pottery and prosecco nights, so that's just quite a nice evening when um, you can bring bring your friends for an adults uh, session without the kids, sit and have a glass of wine and paint some pottery. So they're proven to be quite very nice. Successful. And what about uh, general opening hours for anybody? Just yeah, so we're open from ten till five. Um, most days we close on a Tuesday. That's the only weekday that we close, and then on a Sunday. Um, we're open just for private functions. So if oh, you right, want, yes. If you want, yeah, if you wanted the studio for a birthday party or an event, then we do those on a Sunday because the studio's not really big enough to do them during the week. But yeah, 10 to 5 weekdays and Saturdays. Right, fantastic.
And is there a telephone number just in case people wish to get in contact with you? Yeah, it's 01757 704 784. Right, that's fabulous. And is there anything else you would just like people to know before I finish? Yeah, just that pottery painting is fun. It's, it's fun art, it's not fine art. You don't have to be in the least bit creative to come and have some fun here. A lot of the pots have got designs already etched onto them, so it's just like colouring in. Um, but yeah, it's just really good fun. I mean, I admit it's been very, very, it's been very relaxing this morning to do that. Yeah, everyone says that. Everyone says it's quite therapeutic. It's just, it's just a bit of chill out time. Um, it's good fun for kids, but it's relaxing for adults too. Right, excellent. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Just wanted to say a big thank you to Elena and all the other customers who were in the painting pot this morning for letting me film them and for being such fabulous sports. There will be a short follow-up next Wednesday when I return to collect my ice cream cone. And thank you very much for staying tuned to Jude's World. Bye, everybody.